episódio. Part of our business is selling our alpaca products. Well, you can't make alpaca products without alpaca fiber. We sell our products either online or at craft fairs. They're usually pretty popular during the holidays, such as Christmas presents. So then with that profit, we're, allow, we're able to reinvest that in the feeding and hay and medicine for the following year for the animals. A lot of people buy alpaca socks hats and gloves because alpaca fiber is hypoallergenic. Um, it doesn't have the lanolin that wool has. It also has water resistant, odor resistant, and fire resistant properties. Alpaca fiber is warmer than wool and definitely softer than wool. You can get alpaca fiber in 22 natural colors because there are 22 different types of colors of alpacas and alpaca products will give you a 50 degree of comfort no matter what environment you're in. Then the other part is we also offer shearing services. We shear for other people, we have a shearing table, and we take it with us and we offer our services to many alpaca farmers around this area and outside the state as well. So when we bought some of our alpacas from our friends in Ocanto, Wisconsin, they told us about the Wisconsin Alpine and Fiber Fest that they helped to manage. So they invited us the first year to come and watch them, show the animals. So we decided to go there and we learned a lot of stuff. They have a few classes for beginners like we were back then. They had spinning classes, they have the, they have the halter show and they have the uh, fleece show. So you can show the fleece, which is just the, when after you shear, you keep the fleece and then you take to the show and then they just compare it to other fleas and, and uh, they decide which one is better. Whereas a halter show, they're sh you're showing the animal, so they're judging the animal and the fleas. The white male surrey that we have, Phoenix, um, he is really known for his consistency of his um, quality of fiber. So this male has won blue ribbons and championships. On, he's a white male, so he's won yearling championship on white surrey male and and also the, on the fleece show as well. He actually won like the national champion and so they get advertised in like every alpaca magazine. So that's one way to really advertise for your farm is to say that oh you got the grand champion like of the whole country so that's really really nice. But yeah so we're trying to increase the quality of our fiber right now in the alpacas that we have. So we didn't place as high as is what we would want to last year, but over the years as we keep, you know, improving on like the genetics of our alpacas, that those ribbons will hopefully increase. At one of the first alpaca shows that we went to, my friend from Ocanto, she kind of introduced me to the idea of a spinning wheel. And I thought it was a pretty cool idea. So then I signed up to take a spinning class and it was very hard. <laughs> it's still very hard for me to like spin very well. Um, but since that fair, I've taken a few different spinning classes. So um, and I can practice from time to time, but I'm still not very good compared to like these spinners that have been spinning for years and years and years. Basically there's like you know, hundreds of different kinds of spinning wheels. This one is a Spinolution. It's really easy to transport. It has one of the bigger um, bobbins so you can make more yarn with it. You know, it's just a really nice spinning wheel. It's hard to find like a really good one because most of the spinning wheels that we have in the U.S. are like really like antique ones that aren't really meant to be like, you know, industrial alpaca spinners. Um, but yeah, so this one works pretty well. Um, Really, it depends on the person, like what kind of spinning wheel they want because they're just like vary so much in different kinds and what they can do. So I'm still kind of a beginning spinner, um, but I would like to eventually start, you know, spinning more yarn and then eventually um, like make our own hats and socks and things like that. So it'd be very nice.